Welcome to aminacademy.com. In business statistics, let us discuss about histogram. The histogram is a popular graphing tool. It is used to summarize discrete or continuous data that are measured on an interval scale. It is often used to illustrate the major feature of the distribution of the data in a convenient form. This is a histogram for some frequency distribution. Now this is the data are continuous. In bar graph the spaces are there between the bars but in histogram the bars are connected together. So it is a discrete and continuous variable. Now let us discuss somewhat about uh, difference between histogram and bar graph. In histogram it is a two dimensional figure in bar graph it is one dimensional figure. The frequency is shown by the area of each rectangle. The height shows the frequency and the width has no significance in bar graph. But histogram the width has some, uh, some uses, some meaning. Now in histogram it shows rectangles touching each other in bar graph. It consists of rectangles separated from each other with uh, equal spaces. So these are some differences, main major differences between histogram and bar graph. Now let us do an example problem. Look at this uh, histogram. It's a number of workers for their wages, weekly wages in rupees. Here, look at this. This is the number of uh, workers in terms of 10, 20, like 40, it goes and here this is weekly wages in 30 to 40, 40 to 50 like distributions are there. The below histogram shows the weekly wages of workers at a construction site. Answer the following questions. How many workers get wages, wages 60 to 70, construct a frequency distribution table, what is the cumulative frequency for the class? 50 to 60. First, how many workers get wages 60 to 70? 60 to 70 has 16 workers. 60 to 70 has 16 workers. And second, construct a frequency distribution table. Look here. The frequency distribution table we have write daily wages in class interval with 10, that is 30, 40, 40, 50, 60, 70 like. Here you have to fill these values 10, 20, 40, 16, 10, 20, 40, 16, 16, 8 and 6, 8 and 6. Also, Also, you will find cumulative frequency for this distribution. You can write extra things. Cumulative frequency. The cumulative frequency is nothing but write the first as 10, add up with the previous things 22, and that is 30. 30 to 40. 30 plus 40 is 70, and 70 plus 16 is 86. 86 plus 8 is 94, 94 plus 6 is 100. So, this is we are keeping extra columns here. Now, the cumulative frequency for the class interval 50 to 60, 50 to 60 is this 70, answer is 70. We have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.